Next, Claudette Leduc from Lachine, Quebec, and her miracle spray that not only works as a deodorant, she says it cures common skin problems. Hello, dragons. My name is Claudette Leduc. My company is Distribute. And I'm here today to ask you for $100,000 for 20% of my business. I have a phenomenal product and it's called Dr. Mist. We currently market Dr. Mist solely as a uh, all natural aluminum free deodorant that will work up to three days, even if bathing isn't possible. It's an underarm deodorant? Underarm deodorant, but also because of its healing properties, Dr. Mist will work on acne, eczema, athlete's foot. Claudia, who's your friend? This is my beautiful daughter, Kim, our assistant. Here for support and some eye candy. <laughs> <laughs> and she is well, I think Claudette's figured out the key to a good presentation. <laughs> exactly. And you know what, Robert? It's working so far. Yeah. <laughs> I got a bathing suit actually underneath if, if I need to like pump things up. The bathing suit? No? <laughs> just throwing yeah. that out there. Yeah. Arlene, just don't listen, listen to her. How do, you apply, how do you apply this stuff? Okay, well, Kim, if you don't mind, she will give you a sample. It's yeah. a spray on. I just want it. Of course. It is fragrance free. For you, sir. Can I make anything that smells bad today smell better? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> the Dead Sea has a very high concentration of minerals higher than any other body of water on Earth. Water in a bottle. You're, se <laughs> you're selling water in a bottle. It's not water. It is not water. Dr. Mist is a blend of minerals suspended in a special formula that Claudette says flushes toxins from the body. And unlike most deodorants, it's aluminum free. <laughs> what were last year's revenues in your company? Great question. Uh, $255,000. Really? Yeah. Wow. What do you guys think is so big at $250,000 in sales? How many people come out here with great kooky products have no distribution? How many retailers have it listed right now? I've got London Drugs, I've got the London um, Loblaws banners, including Maxi, Fortinos. So how big do you think the deodorant market is in Canada? I'm going to guess it's $200 million It's a, a billion year. dollar industry. A billion a year? It's and a billion And you have dollar. no market share in it. Wait a minute. I've only had this product for a year and a half. No, you've had no, the no, product for six years, seven no, years. No, 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 I, no, 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 the inventor had it. I'm not the inventor. Well, you're not the inventor. Is Kim the inventor? <laughs> no, she's just the eye candy. Kim, you, you're smart, you need to stop, okay? Why didn't you tell us that at the beginning? Well, because I thought that you'd be interested in knowing the information first. Where is he? He's in Malaysia. What do you pay back to the inventor? Nothing. Nothing? How does the guy give you the rights for nothing? They trust me, they love me, I've, I've built their business. Clinton, I love you too, but <laughs> I, seriously, no. you don't pay him anything? No, no. royalty, nothing? No. no. Have you met so this man? I've spoken with him once on the telephone. You've never we met did. him? I can't, right, Malaysia. You know. There's airplanes. Yeah. Well. Is there any way to get any equity from Dr. No in, his, in what he owns? That I don't know. Have you ever asked him? No, I haven't. Claudette hasn't invented Dr. Mist, nor does she own the patent. Only an exclusive distribution deal from a mysterious man in Malaysia. A story that doesn't quite add up for Arlene. There's something that, you know what, I, I just, there's pieces that don't fit for me, Claudia. I can't quite figure out what it is about you and your story. But we need yeah. the marketing skills for sure. I mean, you're a distributor, but your, your background is not in marketing. You're no. very pleasant and people love you, but that's not enough I thought you to were here you. to help her. Let's give her the benefit of the doubt. I'm just okay, trying to, like, what right. I want to find right. out, the reason I invest, you know, is to make money. That's all I care about. What I'm worried about here is this thing ends up being a huge hit, and then when somebody wants to buy it, I have nothing. I'm just a distributor. You're just a distributor. That's all you are. Well, you guys contemplated. I, I've got so many hurdles in my mind from your story she has through sales, to. Early. I don't care. I don't even understand how she's got sales, frankly. I don't know how people even know what this product is. I don't get it. I don't quite think your story fits the way it needs to fit for me, so I'm out. 
I'm intrigued, but because it's a distribution agreement, I can't get excited. I'm an equity, own it, control it kind of guy. That keeps me out of the deal. I'm out. I have no problem with the distribution. Uh, it's a good cash flow business for you. My challenge is the 100 grand, because I think 100 grand is going to go like mist. I'm out. OK, anyone else in? Because I'm going to make an offer. I will give you the 100000 for 20% of the company. From the date of investment, I would look for a 5% royalty payable on all sales. You guys can go and think about it and talk about it in the back if you want. Did you have uh, anything else you wanted to? I'll wait till see what happens here first. Yeah, I know what the offer is. Okay, so the hundred thousand dollars. Like I know how to market it. I know how to to use those funds. But he wants another five percent for each sale. I don't know. What was wrong with that story? There's something wrong with it. I'm telling you. You got to take a higher royalty. Your equity's meaningless in a company like this. Yeah. What am I gonna do? You can have a counter offer. We have nothing to lose. Just think okay. of you. Wait, 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 wait. What are you gonna ask for? I don't think you should say okay. He wants five percent. It's not ideal. Three. Go. No, Three. ask for less. And then I he can let some stress. You're stressing me out. Ask for less. Okay, I know what I'm gonna do. Thanks. Okay. <laughs> Would uh, those royalties be negotiable at all? Yes. You can take them or leave them. OK. Do you have anything that you wanted to? Brett's offer is a good one. So for that reason, I'm out. Can we ask for more? <laughs> you can ask for more. <laughs> you got to learn when you've got the order done. <laughs> Good lesson. Yeah, that's a sale. Yeah. Yeah. You got mom. a deal. All right. Perfect. <laughs> Thank you very much. It was nice meeting you. Great job. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> Those dots just didn't connect for me. <laughs> we got a deal. <laughs> oh, oh gosh. Oh.